Hey everybody, it's Free Layla K. I got style. Today is a monumental day. I am getting my ears pierced. Yes, I already have two piercings, but I'm getting my second holes and my tragus. I heard that the tragus hurts a lot, so we're gonna find out. I'm excited because I want mad piercings, and my mom finally agreed to it. She was like, okay. She was like, I guess. Like, I'm gonna get them eventually, so like, why not do them now? I'm so excited, you guys. I'm really nervous though because nobody's going with me. Afterwards, I'm also going to Spirit Halloween because I need to buy some fake blood and vampire teeth for a look that I'm doing. And also devil horns if they have them. If they don't, then whatever. I don't plan on spending too much money. The only amount of money that's like big that I'm going to spend is at the jewelry place because it's real gold and they're like super high end. But it's gonna be worth it because I won't get an infection and they don't do it with a gun, they do it with a needle, which I feel like is way better because you get less trauma that way. Right now I'm fixing my wig. I like the color a lot. Like I probably would dye my hair this color one day. Nah, I'm kidding. Maybe imagine though, but I'm just detangling it because I lost my bonnet. So I've just been sleeping in scarves, but it doesn't work out. If some of you don't know, I live in New York. So New York is cold like all the time. It just hit like the 50s and early in like early 60s. So that's what we're dealing with. This wig is synthetic. It's not real human hair as you can probably tell because you can see it. But I think I did, I laid it down pretty okay for my first time with a wig. It gets so tangled, like synthetic hair tends to get tangled OD. I also need a curling iron, so if I have money left over, then I'm gonna buy a curling iron. Because I have a curling wand, it just does not work at all. It doesn't do anything. And then the ends are looking a little rough, so I might pass the iron over there. I'm gonna do the other side, and I'm gonna start my makeup, and then I'll come back to pick my outfit. <laughs> So I did my hair, I did my makeup. I just started doing like the top half of my makeup. I don't even bother with the bottom because masks. So they're not gonna see the bottom of my face. And plus I kind of like the more natural look. I just did eyeliner and then I put the dips in there and then I did my new eyebrows, which are just straightened up because I shaved them and I like them that way. Um, okay. I'm just gonna wear all black. I'm wearing a black turtleneck. <laughs> black jeans and a black jacket. I don't have, I have like an hour and some change before I have to leave so I might paint. I'm definitely gonna tidy up my room so that when I come home I could just get right into the poison ivy look and that's it. When we go to Spirit Halloween, we're looking for vampire teeth, fake blood kit, not like a pint of fake blood, but like a fake blood kit and then some ivy leaves for poison ivy and then a curling iron if we can. I don't know if I should get both of my traguses done or just this one, but like, We'll see once we get there, because I have no idea. <laughs> I could not find my black jeans, so I just had to throw on my khakis, which I guess is fine. But it doesn't make sense because I, the black jeans that I was gonna wear are the biggest jeans that I've got, and these are my second pair of biggest jeans. So where did the black ones go? It doesn't make any sense. I think I'm gonna do that pink. Where is it? That pink bag right there, <laughs> just because I'm not carrying a lot of stuff, and my glasses are pink, and I just want to put together, even though the colors of the day are black and dark blue. So yes. <laughs> okay, so I just left my house. I'm walking to the train station. I have a package to drop off because somebody made an order. So I'm gonna take the train towards Queens and then I'm gonna take the train not towards Queens. Um, It's actually not that cold as I anticipated. I thought it would be way colder, but it's not. My outfit is like super basic though, like super basic. My wig kind of got tangled on the ends, but you know what? It's all right. It's all right. I'm going to do a montage, and I'll see you when we get to the piercing place. Okay, right now I'm in the elevator to go up. I'm kind of scared, but... It's okay, we shall see. I don't know if I'm gonna be allowed to film or not, but we'll see, we'll see. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm good. Biscuit, biscuit. <laughs> Thank you. 
Uh, what are you looking to get done? Uh, my second holes in my trigus. Cool, cool. Yes. So with earbuds, just so you know, you won't be able to wear earbuds for a little bit. Okay. Um, I would say like... So I got my ear... I'm on Lexington. Lexington is for not me because there's like OD rich people over here and lots of outdoor dining. The amount of stairs that I'm getting from like my orange hair is OD. Okay, fun fact, I hate Halloween stores because they just, they, they give me a vibe that I do not enjoy. Okay, I'm getting like, <laughs> The heebie jeebies, ew. Okay, I need to get a, the devil horns and wings. I don't know if I, they have like a corset thingy that I might get, but like I don't really know if I should just get these because they have horns like these, but then they have like the ones that are headband. I could either do a demon or a devil. What? Wait, hold on, because I'm not prepared. I'll just photoshop the wings in because the wings are out of my budget. I don't feel like doing all that. Why am I looking at... What's his name? That Tiger King? Look at his costume. Never in my life. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, we have a successful one. I only spent $34. I got satin gloves. I got the horns. And then... I got, what else did I get? I got the fake blood and the vampire teeth. And that was it. We didn't, I thought I would spend at most $15, but it's fine. It's okay. I'm back like three weeks later and it's time to clean my piercings. Am I dreading it? Yes, but I have something important today and I have to look nice. So we're just gonna see what's in this bag. Okay, healing guy. I probably should have oh so my tragus is gonna heal in six to nine months but then my earlobe can heal in two to four months oh my god they gave me a lollipop that's so freaking cute look yeah this is a sterile saline wipe that's all that came with it no there's something else in here what is that oh my gosh it's a pin and it says good girl that's kind of nice okay i don't really know how to so I thought it was about to be like super intricate and I needed to like take them out and cotton swab them and stuff. But literally it's just a saline wipe. Cause like I have a lot of like pus and stuff like around my ear. The tragus really doesn't hurt anymore. So I've been sleeping, oh. I've been sleeping on my side where the tragus is. And now it's kind of, I think it's kind of bad cause they're saying that it can affect healing time. And I don't, I really don't want it to affect my healing time because I want to change this out as soon as possible. They said I could change it out in like three months ish. I think I'm going to go to studs to do that because if I'm not mistaken, I think their stuff is like pure gold or something. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Three, two, one. Like I style. Peace. Bye. Ever since the day that you went away.